X-ray. X-rays are basically the same thing as visible light rays. Both are wave-like forms of electromagnetic energy carried by particles called photons. X-ray technology was invented completely by accident. In 1895, a German physicist named Wilhelm Roy Chen made the discovery while experimenting with electron beams in a gas discharge tube. The X-ray machine is composed of an X-ray tube that contains a pair of electrodes or conductors called a cathode and an anode. The cathode is a filament that releases energy with the introduction of an electrical current much like that of a light bulb. The cathode energy is released in the form of electrons. The anode, located on the opposite end of the X-ray tube, is a disc made of tungsten, a material that attracts the electrons. When the electrons released from the cathode come in contact with the tungsten, they release energy in the form of photons. These highly energized photons are channeled through a lead cylinder and a series of filters creating an X-ray beam. The X-ray beam is a high-energy beam that can be absorbed only by dense body tissues such as bone. During an X-ray, a radiographic film is placed behind the patient and the patient is placed between the film and the X-ray machine. The X-ray machine then focuses the energy beam at the specific area of the patient's body. As the X-ray energy passes through the patient's body, the photons of the beam reach the film and cause a chemical reaction. The areas where X-ray energy passes through the body becomes black, while the areas where energy is absorbed by the bones appear white. This process produces a radiographic, which is commonly referred to as an X-ray. X-rays are not just used for imaging the human body for medical purposes. The same basic process is used to scan baggage at many airports, check suspicious packages at a post office or courier depot, and to scan the interior of walls to check for electrical lines and pipes before demolition of the wall.